Hey guys, welcome to another video. In this one, I'll be talking about how to make your SaaS product seem extremely affordable and make the pricing seem like a no-brainer, regardless of the competition, how much they're pricing at and uh, how much your current price is. Um, unless, uh, like, if you're solving a big enough problem, uh, you can do easily do this and uh, it, it works really well. I'll show you a few examples in a second. Uh, so basically, a, a normal landing page, uh, a normal pricing page, and in, in the, their normal message of uh, a, a SaaS website is, okay, here's something. Uh, it doesn't really talk about the pro the problem you're they're fixing. Doesn't talk about the cost of not fixing that problem, and um, it it just makes it seem like it is an expense. You're not really s s uh, triggering triggering that uh, investment mindset, and uh, you're not attaching your pr product to the result it can produce and how much that result is worth. So if you look at that like a, a normal pricing page, it just looks like this. Like you can see, uh, here's a product, uh, it does some widgets for your website for ethic pop-ups and so on. And then you go to the pricing and uh, you can actually see how shitty of a job they're doing because they, they say you can start using for free. Um, they're always trying to avoid the price. They're doing discounts. if when the uh, product is already super cheap um, and that way we know that it's not really working that well uh, because they this is the way that they like the worst way to justify your prices do a discount is just dumb so they just say take advantage of our best offer um, then they just show the price and then uh, they just show like a bunch of features so they're not triggering the investment mindset they're not comparing to other products they're not saying okay here's why this is the best solution here's why it's solving a big problem and uh, here's um, how much of an ROI you can get so in this case here's an example from one of my clients and what we did on a pricing page is, uh, this is a CRM, by the way, is we, we mentioned what if we could close just one more sale a month with FLG. And because the, their sales were high ticket, like if they closed one more sale, they would easily pay for, for uh, you know, FLG, basically. Um, we also compare to the tools they currently use and how much uh, of a price difference it is. Um, uh, and you can basically making the product, uh, the pricing seem like an operator. And here's another example f from Basecamp, which is where I took this concept, concept originally from, is they are constantly mention mentioning that this runs for limited projects <laughs> and unlimited uh, users. And he has way more storage than uh, anything else usually has, because especially the unlimited users thing that they always price per user. Um, and then they say, okay, $99 a month flat. We have all of these features, the exact same features, all of these tools you're already using uh, have, and they are just way more expensive for five people, imagine for the entire company. Um, and that's about it. That's exactly what you need to do on your page is just compare, compare your price and um, try to anchor it to the problem and so on before you even show it. And uh, so people can trigger that investment mindset. Um, if you're interested in, in getting some help with your messaging and explaining and making your product seem like super affordable, explaining your product properly so you get better conversions, you can go to Cortez.design slash free consultation and you can uh, jump on a free call with me after answering a couple of qualifying questions and I'll go ahead and diagnose your problems, diagnose your goals and, and making sh make sure we're a good fit. If we are a good fit, I'll go ahead and mention, okay, here's how I can help, here's how that works and everything. And if you're not a good fit, I don't really have anything to sell because uh, I only work with perfect fits. Um, and if you found this video useful, I would just uh, ask to please share it, like, and comment just to help spread out the message. And uh, I'll be in the comments answering any questions that you might have. Um, looking forward to sharing more content like this. Uh, have an awesome day. Cheers.